Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bike Stadium with its tent light structure. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Belgium against Morocco. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And the contest begins. Yusuf and Nesiri. Here's Bufal. A danger here as he runs at them. Bufal. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. This looks interesting. And the cross into the middle. Can he find the net? And fine goalkeeping. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Jan Vertonghen starts with Toby Alderweireld in central defence. And in attack, Aidan Azar starts alongside Romelu Lukaku. Well, we have to say, Stuart, respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year. So many attributes. What are you looking for from him in this game? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of tricky... Lukaku! Well, I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. Meunier? Aidan Azar waiting to pounce. Well, at one point on its flight, I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties, but no problems in the end. And here's how Morocco will line up. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Nusair Mazraoui plays with Ashraf Hakimi in the fullback positions. Hakim Ziyech plays with Sofiane Bouffal in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. They keep the ball moving. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. And once again, they get the ball rolling. Let's find out if Belgium can react to this setback. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Unahi. Aidan Azar. It's the threaded Azar pass. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Can someone get on the end of this? And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in.
Aguer. Yusuf and Nasiri. Bupal. Great opportunity. And that is defending of the highest order. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not really the ideal clearance. And it goes! That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Into the advanced position, and this would reduce the deficit. Oh, magnificent reaction. Ziyech. Perfect challenge. Hazard. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And I think we've got to conclude it's been a difficult outing this one, Stuart, for Romelu Lukaku. Yeah, he's not had his usual impact, has he? He just hasn't got on the ball in dangerous positions. He's got to keep working hard to find that little bit of space to make something happen, that's for sure. And the ball is rolling again here. Belgium left with a mountain to climb in the second half. Can they respond? Putting his body on the line. And now here's Aiden Azar. Opportunity it is. And there is the goal. Wow, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So Belgium just one behind now. And you sense the momentum may actually be with them. Amala. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Takes on the shots. Tremendous reflexes. Thibaut Courtois. He's driven in the corner. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Amadou Onana. You need your defender to take charge. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Amala. And Nesiri. Going forward well here. Can they convert? In it goes! Delighted to be two in front. Things look good for them now. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Now room to Rom on the wing for Belgium. Well, this would help them get back into the game. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. 
and Nesiri. There's a slide draw pass. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Tielemans. Hazard. And danger still. Well, it's not going to count. Flag up quickly then. Yeah, he was offside by quite a bit there, and he knew it. Yusuf and Nesiri. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Ziyech. Takes the shot. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And there's the delivery. Well, closed down straight away. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And still dangerous. Size. Can he convert? Oh, fine stop. Elects to go short. And they'll get ready for the throw in. Ziesch. A glorious chance. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts. Delivering it. Not the best clearance. Ziesch. Buffal. And he read it well defensively. Ten minutes to go. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Could pull one back here. And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Amala. Oh, showing excellent vision. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. Difficult to stop him. Sofian Amrabat. Options in the centre. That's got to be a Belgium throw in. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Aidan Azar with a lovely ball. Well, as you can see, it's a really good pass by Hazard. And then Lukaku's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball so cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. Belgian fans were hoping for at all a defeat in this one Stuart your analysis well Derek not quite good enough today yes they only lost by one goal but I never felt they were in control of the game a frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time well quite rightly the cameras are affixed to Hakim Ziyech on the back of a terrific performance to add to the growing list Stuart your assessment well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.